tropical storm Gord and gaining strength as it heads for the Gulf Coast. It's our top story at 11. I'm John Paul. I'm Caitlin Lockerbie. States of emergency have been declared in Mississippi and Louisiana. ABC's Kenneth Gibson has the very latest. Tropical storm Gordon intensifying in the Gulf of Mexico. I don't want to see another hurricane like Katrina at all. Evacuations are already underway in New Orleans for people living outside areas protected by the levee system. The National Hurricane Center is warning of a life-threatening storm surge up to five feet in some areas. You don't take any of these storms lightly, even though it may not be a hurricane. Tropical storm and hurricane warnings stretch hundreds of miles. As forecasters say, the storm could dump up to eight inches of rain. Many along the Gulf Coast say they're not taking any chances. Uh, I went to Sam's, bought a bunch of water and stuff for my family. And uh, other than that, just kind of letting all my employees know to kind of prepare because you don't know what's going to happen. The storm already drenched parts of South Florida. This time lapse shows the bands of rain moving through Boca Raton. Farther south, Miami's famed beaches, normally packed with tourists on Labor Day, deserted, shut down on a holiday. Meanwhile, in the heartland, major flooding from a separate weather system. Several days of rain inundated Manhattan, Kansas, in what's being called a 500-year event. An estimated 300 people have been displaced because of the flooding there. Just a little bit of panic, just trying to get it, uh, just trying to get all my belongings together. But I didn't have enough time, so just took baby and dog and wallet and keys, and that's it. Kendis Gibson, ABC News, New York.